Hello again and welcome back to my playthrough of Elden Ring. I am Metal Fox. Thanks for joining me again. We are here in this place called Tombs. I said I think when I came in here I called it Tomb Sword Catacombs. Uh, but it's more accurately named Where's the interest of this thing? Oh weird. Tombs Word Catacombs. And uh, there's like a little slash through here. I guess this is telling me that I cannot travel to a site of grace from this location. Hmm. I don't think I realized that, and now that I know that I'm scared. Now that I know that I'm scared, but we entered way up here and now we're way down here. So these are some big catacombs, right? Sheesh. Show us underground here. And let's see, how are we on flasks? We've got four, so we're doing okay, I guess. I guess I could go ahead and take one since I'm about, at about half health. Okay, so we cleared this place out, and now we're going to go over here and jump up on this thing. And we're going to continue on this way. Get the flames of shooting out down there again. <laughs> I just, uh, I was like, man, I wish I had a map of this place, but you don't have maps of places in Souls games. I mean, yeah, we have the map of the open world area in this game, but you're not going to get a map of this dungeon. Man, I remember way back playing like Ultima 3 on my Atari computer and I had graph paper and I, I mapped out the uh, dungeons as you went through them, but they were like, I don't remember what they were, like 16 by 16 grids or something. They were just a square. So they weren't too difficult to map out. This, mapping out something like this is probably pretty difficult. Unless you've got a lot of practice. So somebody's died here. Okay, we got two skellies showing up here. And um, I guess this guy's going to be a pain in my butt. Okay. Try not to let this other guy shoot me. Uh -huh, you didn't even hit me once, jerk. Okay, go ahead and take another swing at him here. Uh, acquire these uh, materials, more of this grave glove wart. I feel like we have an awful lot of materials and as of now, very little things to do with them. Okay. This is a dead end right here. Why is it always coffin? Down there, we have, oh, I know, I think I know where we are. This is where there's a lever. We're gonna find a lever here. Remember in the last episode, we came across a message where somebody pointed ahead and up and said lever. I think this is it. Boy, I mean, look at all these bones here. I mean, at least for me, there's no easy way to tell whether these are gonna sprout up and become enemy skeletons or not. So far they haven't, but maybe when I pull this lever they will. So indeed there is a lever there, and I love that there's a little plant growing right here. I don't remember if I looked at Grave Violet. I don't think I did. Grave Violet. A purple flower that... Heh, a purple flower than blooms in graveyards. The hue of the ghost flame, it's believed to be useful in calling forth spirits. Hmm. But yeah, I mean, if we go into our item crafting, I got a, I can make a bunch of arrows and bolts. I can make a few throwable items. And then a few things, just a couple things that I could coat my sword or weapon or armament in this game with if I had some root resin. Don't think I've ever come across root resin. And then we have some meat here. Cured strip of meat dried out after picking, pickling in a red medicinal solution. Temporarily boosts robustness. Higher robustness helps to mitigate the buildup of frost and blood loss. Okay. And this one here temporarily boosts robustness. But I can't make this because... Boy. 
I don't have any golden roa. I don't have any crab eggs, and I don't have any land octopus ovary. Okay. All right, let's pull this and see what happens. I'm not sure what's going to happen. Somewhere, a heavy door has opened. Nice. I mean, I thought I heard something. Somewhere, a heavy door has opened. I don't know if I remember seeing a door anywhere. But we're going to retrace our steps. See if we can't find this heavy door. Is this a plant I could loot? I must have already looted it. Oh good, just walking on it. Makes it go back down, that's cool. Let's go, to, go in here. I don't think this is where it is, but we're gonna go ahead and take a peek. Nope. Just, you know, waltzing through these catacombs. Nothing to be afraid of. No, sir. Nothing at all. <laughs> the heck is this heavy door, man? Not under here. Doesn't appear to be over there. Hmm. So yes, there's that's the lever up there. That's where we just were. Huh. This door here, I guess, huh? Guess so. I, I didn't try to open this door when we were in here before, probably because there was a message about a boss ahead, I think. And then this here doesn't help either. The summon thing. So we're probably gonna see ourselves a boss down here. And I don't really feel prepared for a boss. Um, in part because... I don't feel like I'm very close to uh, the entrance to this place, but maybe I am. Let me get my bearings here. Okay, so there's that weird thing there. And then I think right up there is the uh, Site of Grace. Somewhere up those steps, maybe. Okay, so... Or is that it right there? <laughs> there it is right there. Um, yeah, I, I, well, no. I was going to say we could rest at it get our one flask back, but I don't remember how many enemies there are between that and this. So let's just go ahead and see what awaits us. Um, I looked a moment ago to see what I could craft, and I mean, nothing really. I was kind of thinking maybe I could coat my sword with something. Okay, I don't need this in my hand. I'm not going to say thank you to the, the boss. I'm just not. I'm rude that way. Well. Friend required ahead. Oh boy, so that's giving me the impression that this is going to be a pretty tough boss in here if so many people are suggesting that I have a, a friend. Uh, and it doesn't look like there's an NPC summons in here, unfortunately. Well, oh gosh, man. Um, I know I'm being wishy-washy here. Uh, I mean, I've got 2,300 runes that I hate to lose. You know? Let's go back and see if I can't spend these on something. I just feel a lot more confident. Maybe confident isn't the right word, and it's not really. Uh, I, I'm not so afraid of going into a boss bite if I go... Boss bite? What the heck? Boss fight if I don't have uh, many runes to lose. And here I am resting at this, um, thinking that this is where I could travel from. But now that I think about it, I don't think I can travel from here, can I? Can I travel at all from here? I can't. So I can't go anywhere to spend these runes anyway, unless I just completely left the catacombs. Which I can do. Oh. Hi. Where'd you where'd you come from? 
I'm gonna kill you, beautiful thing. Huh. I wonder if these guys are like a nighttime enemy. They only come out at night. Because it's kind of nighttime now. You can see on the little thing in the lower right hand corner. Okay, so now I can travel to maybe a merchant or something and spend some of these runes I've got. Oops. Um, or I could... You know, it's been such a long time since we leveled up. Let's, um, let's go ahead and get about 2,000 more runes and level up. Been a long time. So this guy here, I'm afraid I'll take this. It'll be like 4,000 runes and I'll be in the same situation I'm in now. Looking to get rid of runes. There's, oh, okay, 800. So. Take two more of these. Okay, now we're at... Oh boy, I overshot it, didn't I? Sure did. Good math. Uh, gosh, that's the closest. Well, we'll be alright. We'll be alright. Have a seat. Level up. More strength, please. Thank you. Okay, that leaves me with 457 runes. Let's move on. Let's move forward, and we'll see what kind of enemies we're facing between here and there. Um, you know, that's just a little tiny room in there. Do I want to exchange my stone sword thing or whatever it's called for whatever's on that body there? Uh, the answer is yes. Yes, I do. Oh, wait a minute. Is there somebody already waking up down there? see if I regret this. Oh, he got me. Oh, oh, okay. Hey, stop it. What did I just say to you? I said stop it. Oh, good lord. Crap, now that other one's gonna wake back up. Okay, what did I just exchange my stone sword for? Let's take a look. Nomadic Warrior's Cookbook. Okay, well, that's kind of cool. Nomadic Warrior's Cookbook. Let's go back up here real quick. Get our health back, and we'll look at that cookbook. Who's this one? Uh, let's see. We get Rancor Pot from this one. Okay. So I basically traded my Stone Sword Key for knowledge of crafting Rancor Pot. Rancor Pot. It's right here. Huh. Why can't I craft this? I, it looks like I have the required items. Oh, <laughs> I need cracked pots. Okay. All right, well, that explains it. So this thing here... Enchanted by the ancient Death Hex. Thrown at enemies to spawn vengeful spirits that chase down foes. In the times of old, the dead were burned with ghost flame, and from those cinders arose vengeful spirits. Okay, well, let's see what awaits us in here. See if I could spend the next hour fighting a boss. I mean, I'm really thinking this is going to be like a, like a boss boss. We'll see. We shall see. This, again, it just says friend required ahead. Here we go. Okay, we've got Cemetery Shade. Is it just you? Ow, ow, ow. Gonna get me in trouble. Oh, oh, what is that thing? Okay, oh. Oh, well, that's baloney right there. 
That's the baloney right there. Oh, that's an interesting sound effect. Okay, let's see here. How am I going to fight this thing when I can't even hit it? Uh, looking around the arena, not really seeing anything. Wolves in here to distract it. Okay, try not to get hit. Ouchies. Oh, okay, that was not well done. Come on, wolves. Yes! All right, okay. Well, my. My friends were the wolves. Uh, Lutel the Headless. Well, this looks like another spirit that I just used there. Nice. Well, that really wasn't that bad at all, actually. Lutel the Spiritless right here. Summon spirit of Lutel the Headless. Spirit of a headless knight who leads the mausoleum soldiers. Wields a lance enrobed in death and hurls spectral lances at foes. Lutel sacrificed her life so that in death she could continue to protect a soulless demigod until their revival, earning her the hero's honor of Erd Tree Burial. Cool. That was awesome. What on earth am I looking at? Acquire materials. Root resin. Really? That's that's it? Well, I mean, I guess what we got was was uh, some good old good old spirit seed rump. Might as well pick this stuff up that's just lying on the ground here. Okay, well there you go. I am quite all right with that. <laughs> I have no qualms about that being way easier than I feared it would be. In fact, that's how I prefer it. I didn't look to see how many runes I got from that. Uh, we're up to 2787. Hey guys, what's up? Remember me? Okay, well, there you have it. That was Tombsward. Catacombs, and doggone it, I should have rested at, um this thing to get my uh, health and FP back. The drawback will be that those um, floaty jellyfish will be out there again, but that's okay. Late night. Hmm. So there's even a time called late night. Um, I mean, ah, sh let's just level up again. Let's go ahead, man. What am I doing? I need, uh... 1,700, I think. So this will give me 800. Now, whoopsies. Now I need about, about 1,000 more. And we should be able to do that from taking five of these, because I think each of these are 200. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and level up. I mean, I'm just moaning about how difficult it is to get runes and level up in this game where I'm holding on to all those runes in my inventory. But I, I, always, I like to hang on to those for when I, you know, Want to top off. Oh good, they're not back. Okay. Okay. Well, let's take a look at the map, see where we are. Can I get to the base of this tree here? To that direction. Or am I at the base? No, I think we need to get around this. Let's see if I can go around this way. Kind of looking like not really. Oh, there's a dude up there. 
the name over the top of my head. Let's see if we can go around and get up there to where that guy is. Go check it out. What kind of goodies do you give me if I kill you? You're a quick little thing. I heard some things pop up. Oh, you get nothing. Come on. Okay. You can't get up there. Got this guy here. Can I sneak up behind him? Oh, nope. Ouch. Cool looking dude. Cool looking dude. Uh huh. Uh, whatever that is, it's kind of moving a little bit. What in the world am I looking at? We got one of these things here. Oh gosh, there's even a summon thing over here, a summon pool. Hmm, I can't seem to examine it. Well, you have to stand up. You gotta be a man and stand up when you look at those things. Oh my gosh, that guy is one scary looking dude. And it looks like he's got some friends around here that I'd like to get rid of first if I'm gonna seriously take this guy on. Minor Erd Tree. Okay. Well, let's see if I can get to the Erd Tree without having to fight this dude. Where is he? Oh, there he is right there. Matter of fact, I'm, he might even be facing this direction. Okay, we got a dude here. Ooh, I'm surprised he hasn't seen me yet. Oh, okay. Got some other dudes walking around over there. And they hear a little sound or something. One last gasp. Minor Erd Tree. Tarnished Golden Sunflower. That might be the first time we've picked one of those up. I believe it is. Hmm. Don't know what it looked like. Huh. Don't, uh. There it is. It's tarnished golden sunflower, a large flower that blooms facing the Erd tree. Found near minor Erd trees, though wilted and faded. It still retains holy essence. So it's like somebody's playing some music over there in that direction. And that is one... Oh, it's just one of those guys. Okay. Oh, we got one of these things, which I don't need right now. Listen carefully and then try down. Well... Hmm... I think these guys are a little easier to fight on horseback. Come here. Okay. We got some music playing here. Praise the sound. Oh. Oh. The whiff. Oh. Okay, good. 
Get rid of those guys. First off, monster. <laughs> uh, where did I see that? Remember over here in this direction? I thought I'd seen somebody sitting on a... Uh, Got on a ledge or something. I don't know where he went. There's some fire over there, it looks like. Some smoke. And he died here. He fell down there on his horse. And, um, seemed to have no luck fighting whatever that is down there. I think I could pull that thing up here. Oh, there's a bunch of them, it looks like. Why don't you come up here and fight me? Huh? Why don't you come up here? Come on up. Well, looks like he's thinking about it. Where did that guy go? You know what I'm talking about, right? Where was that? So, yes, I am avoiding the big, scary-looking dude over there. Oh, there's some fire over here. What are you guys doing? <laughs> um. Well, let's see what's going on over here. Sure hope I don't regret this. very disturbed that I can't find where that guy was. I'm a little worried that let there be fire. Okay. That I'm going to fall off the edge here. Alright, let's um, try to be smart about this. Are you alive? No, you're the one that I killed a moment ago. Lover ahead? Ah, oh, sound, but so lonely. Oh, so lonely. Get us a golden rune. Butterfly. Okay, I think, yeah, there's more than one dude over here. So if I could pull this guy back here, fight him away from that other guy, that would be beneficial. Poison. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna fall off this edge. Ouch. Okay, got him. Unfortunately, I have no way to cure this stinking poison, man. Shoot, well that sucks. Okay, get rid of him. Oh, another one. Not out of the woods yet. Okay, I'm out of the woods now. Come on, hop off the horsey. There you go. Oh. There's a body here. I'm going to run out of uh, health items before this poison goes away. Sliver of meat. Really? I came down here for a sliver of meat? That's what I came down here for? I tell you, I'm a little disappointed. Liar ahead, item ahead. Yeah, that's. Uh, I don't. I don't believe you. Well, I th I'm gonna have to go back to that um, site of Lost Grace here because I can't survive this poison. I will run out of health items before I get out of poison status. So. Let's go ahead. Boy, it's way up here. That's the closest one, huh? I don't really have much of a choice. I gotta go back up here, get this effect off, and get my uh, 
flasks back, unfortunately. So just traveling here counts as resting at it. Oh, good. They're not here. So, um, let's see if I get my bearings. There we go. So that's over there is where looking this way. It's as far as I could zoom in. So maybe right about here. Oh, I could have more than one beacon. Cool. I'm not sure how to get there. But I put my marker in a pretty good place, I feel like. Okay, since I can't... I don't think I could go this way. Um, I mean, I could probably go down there, but then I'm down and then I can't get up to where that guy is. And it's so important that I go loot that guy. Come on. It's very important. Let's see if we could zip on over there. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. There we go. Gotta get that. Okay. This marker's over here. <laughs> right. You will live another day. Oh, man. It's way down there? Really? Oh, wait a minute. That's where I put my marker. Um, <laughs> where is this guy, man? Is he down there? Let's get a look at it. Oh, this is crazy. Boy, I cannot get my bearings here. Oh, no. Well, I didn't die, but now I am down here. Oh, I'm just back here again. Huh. All right, we're going. I'm going this way. I know I'm not going to be able to get up there, but... So where did I put this other marker? I don't even... I don't even see my other marker now. You got a bunch of dudes down there. They might be scary. Okay, so this... is... right under that. Okay. So what I'm going to do, we'll just hop back up here, since I can't, I don't think I could get back up there otherwise. We'll hop back on our horse. Oh, hi. Okay, so I think it's just below this thing here. There he is, way down there. Okay, can I get down there from here? Okay. This is saying time for jumping item ahead. And there is, but it's way down there. Oh, what's this thing? Oh, what are these things? Not sure what these are. <laughs> Hold still while I give you a shave. Okay. Take care of those guys without too much trouble. Oh, 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 did you see that? 
There's a site down there. Okay, that's nice, but I don't think I can get to it from here. So this looks like a very far fall. I don't know if I'm going to survive this, but if I don't survive it, I don't know how else I'm going to get to it. So. If, if I die, it's not that big of a deal. Not even a scratch. All right, what do you got? I worked so hard to get here. Eclipse Crest Heater Shield. Thanks, dude. Eclipse Crest Heater Shield. Well, it it's better. It's considerably better than the one I'm using. Uh, except that it does not have a skill. This one has parry on it. This one has no skill. I'm not using parry anyway, and I could put a skill on this thing with ashes. So we're going to switch to this weapon. Not weapon. This shield. We're going to get rid of this beacon. And, uh... Gosh, it's, it's, that looks like a far way down now. Can I get... Well, I have to be able to get down from here, don't I? I guess... Hmm. How do I get down from here without killing myself? Aside from just fast traveling to a... Site. Okay. Dude's fine. He's totally fine. Okay. Alright, let's go ahead and grab this. Since I'm aware of it. Even though there's more, still more work to be done up top. Oh, what's this? There he is. There he is. Check that guy out. Yikes. Okay, so this site of Lost Grace is called... Oh, Tombsward. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, I meant let me grab this here. Oh, he's got a big bell down there. That is neat. Am I supposed to fight that thing? That is crazy. That's pretty cool. And then down here... Huh. Got these headless... Dudes. Kind of ghosty. All these dudes are headless. So, are these like the um, spirit that I just picked up? Lutil the Headless? Wields a lance and robed in death and hurls spectral lances at foes. Spirit of a headless knight who leads the mausoleum soldiers. I mean, are these mausoleum soldiers down here? I don't know. Sure, are a lot of them down there, though. Don't know if they're like protecting that dude or what. All right. Well, we are at 721 runes, which isn't very many. Wrong button. So we're gonna cruise back up here again, and we're gonna run up there, and I don't know. Maybe we'll try to fight that big dude at the base of the tree. Probably a mistake, but I think we got to do it at some point. And we might as well do it now before I leave this area. Man, items just keep coming back. Like, I, I've picked that item up many times already, and it just keeps on coming back. Okay. Let's see here. Let's see how hairy this gets. Let's take these guys out first. Get rid of him. Pretty sure there was another one over here. Well, this isn't him, but we'll go ahead and get rid of him anyway, since he seems determined. Darn it. Okay. 
probably easier to fight that guy on foot, maybe. And then over here... I thought there was another one of those dudes. I really don't want to get into a fight with this big guy. And then have little guys show up. Pestering me. <laughs> okay. Alright, enough flower picking. There is a dude way over here. I don't know how much space I'm going to need for this battle. But we'll go ahead and clear him out. Minor Erd Tree. Okay. Well. What are we going to find at the Minor Erd Tree? Besides that giant looking boss dude. Okay, we got another one of those dudes over there. Okay. Well, ah oh boy, here we go. Yeah. What were those materials back there? What was that? You saw it too. It said acquire materials. What were they? I don't see anything on the ground. What is it? Oh, it's that little sunflower right there. Okay. What's this say? Time for I did it. Where is he? <laughs> there he is. I want these sunflowers. Man. Um, I don't know if I should be on a horse for this or not. Bird tree avatar. Oh. Okay, you can't roll on a horse, but that didn't hurt me. <laughs> I keep trying to roll on my horse. Okay, now that, go that one got me. That one got me. And a big whiff. If I had stamina, I could hit him. Oh, my horsey's okay. Oh, nope, my horsey's not okay. Okay, this changes everything. Man, is he healing? I'm not sure what this is. Darn it. Okay. Back off a little bit. <laughs> help me out, wolves. Oh, help me out, wolves. Oh, man. Doggone it. I was doing so good. Shoot. Doggone it. Ah. Um, yeah, there's a stake right here, I think. We'll go ahead and rest here. So I should probably craft some food for my horse, but I, I don't really notice a health bar for my horse. So, um, yeah. Let's see, what's the thing? for my horse. Yeah, this thing. On horseback, feed to torrent to raise HP. But that's just another thing I have to manage. Oh, I gotta get my uh, runes back also. Oops, missed him. 
Okay, well, uh, why don't I just stand there and uh, let this guy... Oh, gee whiz. Wail on me a little bit. I mean, do I want to go ahead and bring these guys into the... Let's put the jellyfish in here for fun. Darn it. You're not off to a good start. Jellyfish not really doing a lot of damage. Oh, man! Did you see that total whiff? Doggone it. Well, this battle's not going well at all. Not at all. So I think the jellyfish... Ah, son of a gun! May have poisoned him. That'll help, but it's not really doing a whole lot. The jellyfish is almost dead. Poorly timed. Man, this is not a good start. Up. Oh. oh, wow. Sure. I don't know. I could stay behind him. Darn it. I could hit him. Oh, shoot. No, that hurt. So I'm out of flasks. Okay, this does bad things. There goes my jellyfish. So no more distractions. Oh, I'm in front of him now. <laughs> I jumped off my horse. Oh, and I timed that very, very poorly. Here comes this again. Run away a little bit. Oh, God! Oh, I didn't know that was going to happen. Damn it. Okay, all right. Oh. Oh. Come on. Oh, come on, move. Oh, that was freaking annoying. I was staggered and I couldn't move. Doggone it. I know I could beat this guy. At least I think I can. Maybe a combination of the wolves and uh, my horse. Let's try that. I want my uh, things back. Get my wolves out. Right behind this guy. What the? My horse already dead? That sucks. <laughs> okay. This is um actually pretty typical as far as boss fights and souls boss fights and souls games. <sighs> why can't? Why am I not rolling? I generally get worse before I get better, if I get better at all. It's just pretty typical. My wolves are almost already dead. I only got one left. Okay, did not mean to do that. I wasted that. Dog on it. Well, this is not going to go well. And that. Oh! Oh, I'm staggered again. Gosh, it's freaking annoying. Get up! Yeah, this is not going well. All right, I'm dead. Um, boy, uh, my first try was my best try so far. Those wolves did not really do anything to him at all. <laughs> All right, we'll try it again. Try it again. That's all you could do is try again. Man, we came so close to getting him that first time. Hello, retrieve lost runes. Oh, nice move. It's... Give my horsey some food. 
man, he totally tracked me. Give him this food, it doesn't give him all that much health at all. Oh, look at that sign floating there. A whiff. He's gonna do that. That always hurts my horse. He's gonna do this thing. Not a fan of this. Hide behind. Ooh! I was gonna hide behind that, but he just shot right through it. Oh, this jerk here. Get out of here, jerk! No! Oh, come on! Ow! <sighs> now I'm poisoned. Man. Golly, that was just horrible luck. Ah, oh, and I did. Doggone it. Well, that's why you kill the uh, little guys before you take on the big guy, but I was just being lazy. Doggone it, man. Ah, that's so frustrating. Felt like I was doing fairly decent that time. All right, let's go fight these guys first. Get rid of these guys so that they don't ruin my fun. Shoot. Jerk. Grab my runes. Dog on it, man. That's so frustrating. And then there's another dude. Over here, I think. That I really don't want to join. Well, oh well, here we go. We're in to win it now. Whatever. And my horse is gone, so now I'm screwed. Fuck on it. Well, maybe today's not my day to fight this guy. Kind of looking that way, huh? Um. Oh, shoot. Oh, darn it! Gosh, there goes my wolves already. Okay, now I'm stuck in a tree. Man, this is terrible. And I was gonna do that again. And there goes my wolves. Man, I, I really don't feel like this guy should be this difficult. There goes my wolves. Here comes this bullcrap again. So just, uh, run, 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 run. Oh, it hit me. Doggone it. This is a kind of annoying fight. Very annoying, actually. There's a turtle over there. Oh, that delay. Doggone it. I am not enjoying this. Oh, come on. Yeah, all right. All right. Well, okay. Not my day for this guy. Okay. Okay. All right. All righty then. Well, see you later. Bye. Um, I'm going to be leaving now. And uh, if I had my bearings, uh, I would run back to my site of Lost Grace so that... Uh, damn it. No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Well, I think I kind of got around here. So my plan was to uh, run away from him. And so that when I died, I was far enough away from him that I could get my runes back without too much trouble. So I hate to give up on this guy, but it's not looking like this is my day for fighting this guy. So... At least I'll get my runes back. Um, 
Man. Every uh, enemy thus far that I've summoned to f my, my spirit summons has not really been very useful. I don't feel like, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to change it. <laughs> I wanted to change the position here. Switch to headless dude. Can I do headless dude at the same time? No. Uh, let's see here. What if I had enough FP? Oh, I removed my SP FP flask. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we'll put that back in here. I just want to see if I can do this. I don't know if I can. Can I have two spirits at the same time? Doubt I can, but let's see what happens. No, I can't. I can't. Oh well. Oh well, so I've got this jellyfish just kind of hanging behind me here. And, uh, you know. Oh, gone it. Well, that sucks. He just killed my horse right off. And, uh, yeah. Or maybe he just knocked me off of my horse. Oh, no, not me. Oh, my God. Oh. Golly, can I miss him any more? Now see, that was bullcrap. I don't really feel like that when it hit me. Oh, my jellyfish is still alive. Oh, it's these. Oh. Oh. Oh, gone it, horse. I told you to run. I just hit my... Oh, this guy's getting in on the fight. Great. Uh, where are you throwing it, dude? I'm out of those. Oh, son of a gun. I can't believe my jellyfish is still alive. Oh, we're going to do this again. still poisoned. This is where I die. This is where I die because he's so close. Man, if I could stay away from him and that poison finish him off. <laughs> finish him off, poison. Finish him off, poison. Yes. <laughs> yes. The poison finished him off. That's so freaking great. Enemy felled. 3,600 runes and an opaline bubble tier. Opaline, Opaline, I don't know. And a Crimson Burst Crystal Tear. Okay, we got some interesting things here. Where are they? I don't know. Where are these things that we just picked up? Opaline Bubble Tear. A Crystal Tear formed slowly over the ages where the Erd Tree's bounty falls to the ground. Can be mixed in the flask of wondrous physic provides significant damage negation however this effect only occurs once and will expire after a certain duration okay and then i also got did i get another crimson crystal tier i don't no this thing the crimson burst crystal tier that's what i got the crystal tier forms slowly over the ages where the erd tree's bounty falls to the ground can be mixed in the flask of wondrous physic the resulting concoction gradually restores one's HP over time. That's kind of exciting. 
Well, we did it. Finally got that guy. And uh, I am quite thrilled about it. And what an exciting way to end another episode in my playthrough of Elden Ring. <laughs> this game is so much fun. <laughs> really enjoying this game. I I'm wondering um, how many of you guys out there watching are playing it as well. I don't know if like half of you, more than half of you. I don't know. I'm just curious. Let me know if you're playing. And what you think of it. Guardian Sword Spear? Hold on a minute. Hold on. Let's see what this thing is. Guardian Sword Spear. Where is it? Right here. Guardian Sword Spear. Uh, boy, I do not have nearly the dexterity to wield this thing. Weapon comprising a long handle and broad blade sharpened from the hardwood of old trees. Wielded by guardians of the minor Erd trees, known as experts in the arts of combat. The power of this weapon scales greatly with dexterity. Skill spinning slash, skill favored by dexterous warriors, slash foes as your body spins. Additional input allows for a follow-up attack. Cool. Well, I won't be using that because I'm not an ex a dex build. Okay, like I said, any minute now, this episode's going to end. Any minute now. Ouch. <laughs> Alright, that'll do it. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.